my dear friends researchers and teachers this video is for you and today in this video i will discuss about to the plum x and alt matrices what are these two things right so how basically uh, these are useful uh, to uh, present your research work to the community in terms of the citation and the social contribution right so if your journal providing either the plum x matrices or alt matrices that means that you are getting some information that how your article is performing in terms of the scientific citation that means someone is using your article as a reference and uh, on the other hand uh, people are finding it uh, so much interested uh, in this uh, uh, in these articles right so uh, in this article uh, they are basically finding some interest and sharing on the social media so how many times this article is tweeted on the twitter and say on the facebook or liked so this kind of information you get either from the plumax or through the alt matrices so before publication check your journal that uh, the journal is providing the alt, uh, alt matrices or uh, the plumax so you can get uh, some idea that how the article of that particular journal is performing or on the other hand you can say or can understand that how the uh, team basically of the journal is working for the published research articles so this thing is very important and uh, being a regular researcher uh, many people are not aware but uh, this is the responsibility of the journal that they provide the uh, content the published paper to the target audience so twitter uh, facebook and other uh, uh, these are the uh, topmost uh, basically the platform where one can uh, share uh, their uh, research articles so plumex and alt matrices provide the information to the reader as well as to the author that how the article is performing in the scientific and social community right so this was a simple uh, idea about to this video that uh, you have to check these things right uh, in the journal before you publish your research article